All right, Peter, walk us through the, the 3.0 version. All right, Flickmatic 3.0 did away with all the wood. Wood rots in the jungle, as it turns <laughs> out, pretty quickly. Um, so 2.0 pretty much fell apart. So 3.0, I got this. I use this thermomorph stuff to morph me up some fancy parts that fit this motor, the stepper motor exactly, that fits the shaft of the stepper motor. Molded it inside one of these, oh, I don't have the tubes with me, but one of these little um, water tubes. And then sculpted this, um, this part so that the string doesn't wind around the shaft and mess that up and this upper part so it doesn't get in the way of the business end. And then we have this flexible plastic here that I've glued to the this rotatable part. So it's basically sort of a concentric circle here. We've got a rotatable part here, a rotatable part here on the outside, on the inside. And so what's going to What's the friction like between the outside and the inside? It's silky smooth. Oh, nice. Silky smooth. Yeah, no friction. Very limited friction. And so what's going to happen is this this nail is going to swing around because this this is driven by the stepper motor below, and it's going to catch this part here, and it's going to start winding it back, and it's going to wind back a little punching bag, punching glove, until a, a point in which it can't withstand the pressure anymore, and it's going to this little bendable part is going to bend back underneath the nail and release all the way back out. Um, punching the tree. So turn it on. We got three switches, of course, for safety. You don't want this thing punching when you when you're not ready for it. So here it goes. Wind it back. Oh, nice! Yeah. Oh, Peter, this is great. Definitely. excited about that. Put that cup in front of it again. Yeah. Oh. Hang on. <laughs> <laughs> oh yeah. Awesome. Totally. <laughs>